Oh, Super Shark Cookie Tech, these guys have played quite a few times already in uh, the, t the 10 11 weeklies that we've had. Oh, yeah, they remember that time where they were playing each other like winners' quarters like almost every week? They almost yeah, played each other tonight, too. Very great stock there from Cookie Tech. And you know, Cookie Tech gone on a run today, right? After losing the Incineroar Ditto to mm -hmm. Vomit, he's been going on a run. Oh, yeah. And now he's in top eight. Hello. You know, Can I you really respect him going for the Incineroar Ditto. That was very fun to watch oh. for the first two games. And then I had the dub. Okay. Cookie Tech off to a really great start here. See what he can make of it. Just short on that Nair to punish the punch the pivot grab. Yeah, this is a this is a massive lead for Cookie Tech right now though. He's got three stocks and he's got 70 on whoosh! Ooh, what are you looking for there? Spot dodge, I'm sure. Still base. He's still base. <laughs> <laughs> oh, oh! Dead? not quite. And he put you know still bad though. Wait, oh, he, didn't put oh, the ram ram. Um I think he clipped Min Min so he was able to up the after the side beat. Maybe that's a yep. Like that, that'll catch it. Uh, that instant ditto was unfortunately off stream. Sadly. It, it was really fun to watch. Woof. Okay. Let's see. Oh, yeah, that's actually something that uh, maybe Cookie Tech can fish for a lot, too. Like those approaching late nares to try and beat out like a single arm. Yeah. If there's multiple arms you know, on the screen, it's difficult. If though. I'm Cookie Tech, Woof. I am chilling in center stage. Oh, yeah. I've seen Steven Shark kill this dude at like 0, 10, 20, 30. Steven so Shark does that to everybody. If I, yeah. yeah, if I'm Cookie Tech, I get a big lead. I'm staying center stage. I don't want to die. Oh, <laughs> I'm oh, staying definitely. away from that ledge. And if Cookie Tech uh, takes game one this commandingly, I mean, that would be really great for his morale, I'm sure, going into like the rest of the set or maybe even the rest of the tournament, because that would be a win on, uh, I think, the three time now uh, the Fantasy State winner, Steven Shark. What? You know what I forgot to mention? Both of the uh, past Advantage State winners aren't losers right now. Oh, that's crazy, that's right. isn't it? So we could have a new champion today. I. This is this is a very exciting time to be in Minnesota, especially live. Oh, into the up air, not quite gonna kill. But for the back air, scouting. Yeah, Min Min doesn't have like the the fastest rolls in terms of frame data, so I mean you can just comfortably kind of react, especially if uh, when you have this lead. Swing. Yep, man, no jump. Min Min really might be, I think, one of the best characters in the game in Edge Guarding Ike. Oh, for sure. It's like, because it, it's relatively low commitment, but it's such a high reward. Yeah. Especially with, like, the tools that she has in terms of Ram Ram, which is, like, a yeah. quick, there's a but lot doesn't necessarily of, kill. There's a lot of characters that can kill Ike for up B. That's, oh, yeah. you know, that's not special. There's tons of characters that, if you force the Ike to up B, you can spike him, you can hit him, you can win box him away. But Min Min, one of the characters that can kill Ike oh, for side right. B. Cross stage. But, Cookie Tech that back one. All right. That was a pretty commanding game. These are 40%. Especially the, the beginning of that? Yeah. That was pretty into Cookie Tech's favor. Steven Shark making it a lot more even at the end, of course, making 40% last stock. But let's see uh, Let's see the adaptions he might make. If I'm I Cookie Tech, I want to get the lead, and I really, really want to hold center stage because I don't want to die to this combos into the Dragon Breath. I get Smashville, because, but then at the same time, it's like a double-edged sword. It's like whoever gets mid-stage right. pretty much wins that yep. stock. And you know, um, there's actually been some discussion I've seen on Twitter of places that are thinking about doing hazards on Smashville because of the way that Smashville is in this game. Oh yeah, with the platform moving I on. know Xanadu next Tuesday, or this coming Tuesday, will be having a hazards on real set. That's true, I was reading about Turn that. Tune into that if you want to see some funky hazards on stuff. Crazy stuff, and also to see Jackie Peanuts. To see Jackie Peanuts, that's right. Let's see. Pretty even so far. This is pretty even. Nobody really has like a commanding space control right about now. Oh, ma oh, that, that's like I like the idea. Just in case he air dodged a little bit earlier, but Tumble, I think, uh, dictated he wasn't now able to do that. Good back air there. Ooh, okay, going for the up. Oh, oh no! He had his jump, he had his jump. That was good. Okay, that was really scary. Ooh, the patience, just waiting. He's just jumping! <laughs> he needs to, he needs to chill out. Dash attack. Oh, dash attack is such a, like, a fun move to hit, though. I understand Co why he goes Cookie through Cookie Tech is insane with these Ike dash attacks. Oh, yeah. There's another one. She, she tried another, and it got stuffed out. I wouldn't be surprised if we see, like, one more here, because it, it should take out one. There arm. it is! There it is. Not gonna take the stock though. Min Min, I mean, notably the heaviest character in the game, so she probably needs a couple nerfs in that area. Uh, God. Okay. Nice, yeah. nice jab to catch the end of that spot dodge. I mean, Cookie Tick is really proficient in using, you know, that jab Ooh, up close. So 
You know, Cookie Tech out. actually, after I played Cookie Tech, mm -hmm. he mentioned that one of the things that he's been doing a lot, he's mixing up when he's fast falling and when he's not. Oh, yeah. When he wants to play a bit more floaty, throw off your parry timing, and I think God, that caught Steven Shark off guard. And that's, such that's such an important thing for Ike to do because, like, an important thing is, like, parrying some of his stuff, especially stuff like Nair. But having that sense of timing that Cookie Tech has, very important. Steven Shark finding the mark on that stock. Okay. Yep, punishing that pivot grab there. Let's see how. Oh, uh, yeah. He missed, missed the, the auto there. cancel on that Nair, so he got whiff punished. Yeah. You hate to see it. Uh, Mods equal game shark. This is true. Uh, there is a game shark plugged in, but unfortunately, it is uh, it's benefiting both of them, so it, it's kind of null about. I like the music. Oh well, yeah, the music's real nice. From Guilty Gear, if I uh, I think it's Chips. I could be wrong. Let's see. Okay. Oh, I do like the dash grab there to Good maybe uh, catch a shield, but Stephen Shark. Stephen Shark's been in those situations with mid mids so often. He knows what people like to do. You know, roll being an option that a lot of people clown on. You know. You rolled there, but if your opponents are oh, like trapping wow. you, wow! Big he, up smash. He, I guess the Steven biggest Shark, of up smash. Steven I've Shark, never seen one that yeah, big. Stephen Shark maybe expecting stuff like an F tilt or maybe another rising back air, but catching spot dodge uh, the up smash. Uh, Cookie tick with the stock lead, but let's see how long that lasts. Yeah. Oh, he missed the fastball on that neutral air. Woo! I like the idea. If he got it, it was death. I think. Yep, for sure. Oh, the tech chase. Really nice. That up tilt hit, that was so weird. Yeah, that was like a very lingering weird hitbox. Yeah. Nice Tomahawk. Dude, he's gotten a lot of Tomahawks in this game. He's gotten so many Tomahawks, and it, it really pays to be up that up close like that, I guess. So maybe I'd like to see Steven Shark kind of threaten that a little bit more, too. Maybe like a rising nair or like a, an up smash. Oh, Tomahawk of his own there. Nice, Not nice side B. Oh, going for the, I guess trying to catch a tether there, maybe if he was uh, delaying it. Steven Shark upstage, that's it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Mm -hmm. I mean, when your opponent directional air dodges, if you can go out there, go out there. Oh, for they sure. They can't avoid your aerial after they've expended the air dodge. Uh, uh, people, especially like characters that have a really good recovery that can come from like way off stage, like Min Min, they like to do air dodge, directional air dodge sometimes uh, to bust themselves out of tumble and Cookie Tech, knowing that, going off stage, he's up 2-0 in this series. Got 2 0 lead for Cookie Tech. Let's see, one of our, um, one of the people in contention for being the best player in state right about Stephen Shark. Game uh, match point, he might be out. Let's see how this set goes. Paul is okay at this game, this is true. But he is also amazing at the game. Yeah. You know who else is amazing at the game? is Stephen Shark. Stephen Shark. He's Absolutely. not going to go down without a fight. Oh, most definitely. Okay. Yeah. Off those strong that right there, there the, way, the way that Cookie Tech avoided the Dragon Laser, that's a few weeks of Min Min experience right there. Oh, yeah. You know? Like, all right, I've been hit by that a few times. Not anymore. I've been in the, I've been in the situation before. You see, like, the, the Raven zoom in, like, the uh, catch of the future. Just, and just choosing the correct uh, counterplay there. Now let's go, Kyle. Actually, do say hello to me, please. Uh, all right, nice jabs there coming from Cookie Tech. Catching Steven Shark at ledge here, where a lot Woo! of his woes in the set have been. He's been neutral, oh. gapping, a, he's been neutral gapping a lot, and I yeah. feel like he's been catching him kind of slacking, e well, even I mean, if not immediate, you know? I don't know what I'm doing on the ledge against Cookie Tech. Oh, it's I'm so picking difficult. an option and just hoping he misses. Oh, that jab into the, the, the grab, catching the roll. A lot of people like to roll after a jab. Okay, forcing his way in there with the dragon arm. Dragon wow, laser that killing. Was, yeah, that was a really good even, laser. Even Cookie Tick surprised. He, uh, an audible gasp. He can catch it in the player cam. I heard it. That's true. It was so, it was so loud. Was, <gasps> he's like, <gasps> wow, I almost, uh, I almost choked there on that one. Let's Are you see. dead? Oh, I Not actually quite. thought Steven Shark would try a down air stock trade. Okay. Steven Shark looking very good this game right about now. Ooh, trying to catch maybe an early up B there from Cookie Tech. Not quite, though. Yeah, that dash tech. Oh, wow. Nice forward air. Let's but, see. yeah, his character's going to be able to make it back from solo. Mm -hmm. Roll down smash. I, I understand Cookie Thick trying to commit there because you do have to make a play. He makes a play there with an F tilt, catching the landing, but he does have a lot of ground to make up here. Ooh, oh, wow. the roll reap, he but had he that was barely off. Just short there. 
but I, I, but I love, I love the heart behind it. Nice dash attack to force himself out of the corner there. Ooh, Not he, quite he was dead. looking for game. If, if Cookie Tick waited a little bit on that jump, he was just dead. Is he dead? Oh, covering the jump. Yeah, That's it. yeah, yeah. Yep. Very good game there All from right. Sadie Shark. Not going down without a fight. As I kind of knew, right? Yeah. Steven Shark is definitely, he's going to turn stuff around. This man won tournaments. He won this oh, yeah. tournament multiple times. This dude wins locals. This man wins locals. He's not going to go down 3-0. Are you stupid? Let's see. I wonder what stage we're going here. I'd like to make like an assumption on what stage we're going, but I have no idea how this matchup goes in terms of stage. Yeah, well. I guess you can make like guesses. PS2 makes sense, to be honest. Running it back to, to the game one. Cookie Tech felt Same really comfortable I'm there. Sure. Yep. Yep, yep. Yeah, I don't think we'll see an Incineroar here. I would love to see an Incineroar. <laughs> Just like. Revenge that megawatt. You know, re no, or revenge uh, the dragon beam, and then he still recovers. <laughs> And then he gets upgraded by uh, a Ram Ram. Rep. Let's see. Or I guess the Joker, but we haven't seen that in about two years now. Nah, the Joker hasn't. Yeah, he, he hasn't played much Joker, I can tell. I, I miss it, but from, I from totally get I it. Oh, catching the landing there. Maybe uh, Steven Shark was trying to force his way you in know, there with a Dragon Arm. Cookie Tech and really a bunch of Ike players, what they do is after their combo is necessarily over, and these people, they'll air dodge or just fall onto the stage. But the Ike dash attack is a burst option that can threaten that with death. For sure. One thing I also want to mention earlier is that uh, Cookie Tick was scouting for a back air off stage. And Steven Shark had the perfect drift to make it back and he punished them for it, which was so smart. But it made the game a little bit more even, yep. but still Cookie Tick in advantage. Once again, he is one game away from... Jump uh, air dodge, he wanted nothing to do with Min Min aerials. Oh my <laughs> god, he really wow. doesn't want to get hit. <laughs> Down air. This dude's in the matrix right about now. Let's we'll see. Good. F tilt into a tech situation. Not going to roll in, though. Stephen Sharks learned his lesson on that one. Yeah, I feel like Stephen Sharks kind of expecting uh, Cookie Tech to play a little bit more grounded game, you know? That up smash came out between the down tilts. Yeah. That move is really fast, Ooh. even if it got nerfed. Oh, catching the drag. Yep. You hate to roll out on one of those, or else you're just going to be pushed further into disadvantage. But Cookie Tech, he doesn't really Wow, care. the auto-cancel down there said he didn't get punished. Wild. Let's see. Oh, the dash attack again. I mean, it was a, it was a good timing for uh, Steven Shark just uh, realizing, you know, maybe it shouldn't be too predictable with these arm throws. Half tilt. Man, getting around Ike at death percent just looks it's nightmarish. so difficult, because he's like, his hitboxes are everywhere, and he's, he's not exactly like the slowest guy either. No, oh, yeah. Cookie took one stock away right about now from finishing the set. Gotta be careful how he recovers. You do Mickey not. Mickey makes it. Uh, yeah. We all right. Four zero doesn't. zero. Yeah, he does not have Ness air dodge, so he cannot make that back. Oh, nice yeah. frame yeah, trap. That, yeah. was, that was a good frame trap. I honestly thought it would have been too laggy, but. Yeah, me too. Even, uh, Woo! Steven Shark getting caught by that, and also that near dare. That was so scary. We're looking for game. Okay, going for the dash stack. Oh, if he jumped, it would have been so oh. over. Oh my god. Maybe he's looking for it again. I feel like maybe now it, it, it's time for him to play a little bit more honest instead of going for like the Nair Dare. Right, now yeah. Steven Shark's he's, gonna be he's taking it. damage. Oh. This is going to be a punish. Yep, punish Nair. That was that, such a good parry. Good parry, yeah. Oh, oh my gosh. That was oh so my sick. god. I mean, I've seen Cookie Tech just die. Oh, <laughs> hey, that'll Cookie do it. Cookie Tech eliminating Steven Shark, the previous Advantage States winner. Great set. Cookie Tech advancing. Cookie Tech making a run and a half right now. This this advantage is so insane. <laughs> this yeah. is so wild. Yeah. You're just like.